the only accurate map, geology map of this area. There ain't nothing better. This is my basement all right? the holes they dug down the bedrock. There ain't nobody ever dug or looked at it. Top, I know I'm right here. Where's the ball? Because I can't show you where it was. So the road was so here. This is uh, Valley View this right is, here. This is a hundred and second eight years ago. It shows the original road to the farm. Anything that's on the road. Let me the bag of my glass. It shows the old road goes over Leslie's house in front of Marion's house. No, I mean, you got to That's the way it was in the right uh, Google when I Googled Right here. At the tip of my finger, yeah. that's the road going into the farm, but that's the original old road. That's, the new road goes down the line. Mm-hmm. You see how this goes there and it cuts across? There's the old, that's the road a hundred and some years ago coming to the farm. And that dot, that's the farm. This farm was here in 1898. Oh, yeah. Here's the third band of iron. It sticks out here, and it sticks out here, and I bet it's right under my garden. There's only one mine into it, and that one of the world's square was rated the richest iron ore in the world. No kidding. It's this third That's band awesome. right here. The Loretto mine was in. So right here for three thousand calls? This green is the core of a continent, and this green, and this is all sedimentary rock that's been squished in between. And there's three continents. There's a continent, here's a continent, here's a continent. This is a subduction zone where one continent went down under another. And right along in here is your point. Here's where it got so hot, all these volcanics, and there's other ones. Right like here, that's where the earth got so hot, it's enough to be a wheat, it's got maximum mass, that's why there's days here, that's why there's a wheat. Right in here is perfect for the formation you got, a, a, you got a marble dolomite up on the granite. Are At extreme metamorphism, that's where rubies are formed. Rubies and sapphires, that's where they're born. Yeah, and the gold one is up here now. It's too sticky. The gold okay. one's way up this here. Yeah, gold one's in the south. We're going to have to go over there. The hand of mine is right up here. Make it as small as you possibly can. You put everything all together that can possibly be. And that's where they're bad, see? And it goes, the sea floor goes that way, and it goes that way, in between the three continents. And the ocean floor, and that's where the iron deposits are, there in the sediment. Because there was no oxygen on there. And when iron weathered on the rocks, and then oxidized it, it was in the mud, it was slate, but it's heavy, so it formed its own layer. Titanium, if it weathered on the rock, then it's full titanium. They'd be sorting it out in the slate too, that's why I'd write chunks of the roots on it. Then the uh, ocean floor sediments that were put there by this rock, the granite is the old ancient core. It would have weathered away into the sea floor. I mean, you had a blob of solid granite or left and grow and no life. But you had storms and rain and it weathered away and washed in and that's what made the sea floor and it squished together. Alright. But real high intense metamorphism. High heat, high pressure, that's what the heavens form. Diamonds form. But right here is where they met. If you go east of here, it's all lined, it's all Michigan basin, it's all covered. That's the red on the hill, there's the sandstone from the Michigan, which is, a, you know what I mean, a billion years later. This became an ocean again about 600 million years or so. Then it started to the land, it goes up and down, you know, and the mountains rise, the mountains fall. 
At one time, this would have been a giant mountain range like the Himalayan. Yeah, when the three gauntlets collided, it would have pushed up and fixed it as well. A lot of heat and pressure.